Hi boys and girls, this is Miss Maggie with the South Ridge Boys and Girls Club. Today, Annalise is going to demonstrate how we make this picture and we're gonna eventually turn it into a dream catcher. So you'll need red, chalk, orange, yellow, white, and blue. And you can have different color blues and you'll need black as well. So Annalise is gonna start with the first part. So she's just gonna paint the top of it red. Oh, and you'll also need a paper towel. And she'll do orange as the next layer. Then she'll do yellow. Now she's gonna do the white. And she'll do blue. You can do different color shades of blue because it's to represent your water. And I'm just gonna add some more blue to my white up here. Now you're gonna grab your paper towel and you're gonna fold it over a couple times and put your finger on it so that you have your finger like this and you're gonna smear it. All throughout your picture. So it looks sort of like this, where it's blended in. You want to switch your paper towel so that you're not putting your orange on a yellow or your on your, your red on your orange and then your orange on your yellow. Keep switching it. Okay, now switch your paper towel for your yellow. Now we're not gonna do the white, we're just gonna go straight to the blue. All right, so this is what it looks like. Then you're gonna grab your black and you're gonna do like a C, an opposite C for your palm tree. And you're gonna put leaves on your palm tree. And then you're gonna do a boat. You do half a circle, yep. 
color it in. And then make your line for your flag. And that's our, our painting. Now we're gonna get a hole puncher and we're just gonna do holes around our paper and get some beads and some strings. You don't need that many, maybe four or five. And then you need to put one on the top as well so that it could be where you hang it from. I need my beads and my string. You can pause it, right? You can pause it. Mm -mm. Right. Mm. I need scissors. Natalie, can you give me some scissors real quick? Thank you, mommy. I forgot scissors. Okay, thank you. Okay, so now Annalise is going to put some holes in her plate to make the dream catcher. And I'm going to start putting my beads on my plate. So this is the demonstration of it. You can put as many or as little bees as you'd like. I'm only putting five. And when you put your beads, the last one you put in, you need to tie it so that they don't come off. Too low. If you mess up and you put it too low, just go back in and bring it back up more, one in between it, okay? It's no mess up in art, never. You can always fix things when it comes to art. All right, you need to grab one of the strings. And see guys, you have, I lost all my strings, all my beads. That's what I do with my split. You put in your one bead and you make a knot so that they don't fall, the other ones won't fall out. So now I got to re-put my beads in. <laughs> Just put it through your hole and tie it in. Tie it up. Out of three, I just was trying to get it so that you can see how, to, how it's going to become. And then you tie this up here so that you can hang it off your wall. So this is the I'm just gonna add three more here. 